That is all. Moving on. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, welcome to WarioWare. Now, I've done this on stream for events before. Uh, you uh, you can guess who this is. Yeah, yeah we, we got the word. But, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to do something a little bit different. Uh, we're going to be playing uh, WarioWare, and for those who are familiar with WarioWare, it is essentially a collection of unusual little mini games. Uh, and your goal is to complete the mini games as many as you can, as fast as you can, and as high as difficulty as you can. Uh, today, we're going to be doing Story Percent, which means we're going to be playing through the story cutscenes, including the intro here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and start the timer once we actually start playing, but we'll go ahead and let the timer run. So the basic gist of the game is Wario is on the couch picking his nose as usual when he sees an ad on TV for a computer game. Uh, game Boy Advance game, excuse me, being very specific, Game Boy Advance game. So he gets it in his brain to go get a computer, go program a bunch of games, get his friends in on the mix, uh, and uh, have everybody make video games uh, for his WarioWare, and then uh, uh, sell it to make loads and loads of hotter cash. Uh, so that's the general gist. We're going to go ahead and jump into it. Uh, and as soon as I start, we'll go ahead and get that running. So we got to feed the kids. Ready for this? All right. All right. Uh, and due to one of the cutscenes, I'm going to pick the lady this time. Uh, it doesn't really matter, male, female. It makes no difference in the gameplay in general. Uh, but three, two, one. It started five seconds ago. But we are going to play through all of the cutscenes because I, on purpose, have cleared the save file so that we can see all the cutscenes. Otherwise, you can skip them. Once you beat them. Once you beat them. That is super loud. Think you can beat my games? Yes. I've done it a few times. Just say. Just a few. Uh, so I am playing this via the Switch, uh, Nintendo Switch, uh, Game Boy Advance application. Um, obviously this was originally available on the Game Boy Advance, but we're doing it via the, uh, Switch's online fun times there. So again, this is a game of a lot of mini-games, uh, such as dodging, catching, throwing, poking, running, whatever the case may be. Um, and the goal is to complete each stage, uh, before losing all four lives. Uh, if you miss or fail a minigame, you lose a life. Uh, and if you do lose all of your lives, you have to start over completely, uh, on that particular stage. Uh, I'm gonna stay right- No, no I'm not. <laughs> Sometimes you can get away on that one and not move at all. Sometimes. Wario! And you can see a lot of the mini games are knockoff versions of quite a few other video games that are in existence. That's the hardest mini game, in my opinion, for some reason. Uh, but yeah, you just gotta play each other. No! He was too quick for my, my very slow, addled brain. Whatever. Alright, here we go. How dare you, Father Wario would never copy it. No, he wouldn't. He would, uh, he, in fact, created all of his own, completely original, do not steal. <laughs> so one fail on the first level. And we completed it. No, no, no. Wario is, uh, still dodging potatoes and sharks for some reason. Yeah, basically, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Uh, there's been several iterations of the WarioWare games over the years for pretty much every Nintendo system, uh, Game Boy Advance and on. Uh, GameCube also had this exact same game, with the exception that, for some reason, they cut out all of the cutscenes and just gave you the mini games, which I'm not sure why they chose to do that, but... Essentially, the GameCube is about the same exact thing as the Game Boy Advance version, with the exception of having less less flair to it for some reason. Again, we figured it'd be on a console like that. 
you would have a little bit more, but uh, but they definitely released at least one or two games per console uh, since then. Uh, and actually, there's at least like almost oh, yeah. two or three per system uh, because Game Boy Advance also had <laughs> Twisted. Uh, which I, I've been meaning to get a hold of, but the DS uh, Gold version has some of those games on it anyway, so you're not too far out of it if you have 3DS and uh, the Gold. Oh, wait! Those stores are down, aren't they? Weird. Alright, on to Jimmy. Jimmy is sports games, so each one of the characters has a sort of theme. Uh, Jimmy's is sort of a sports idea. Uh, and there are three difficulties for Jimmy stages. We start, of course, on the green easy stage. Uh, most of the games are very similar between them. Uh, but that's, that's what it is. Uh, but yeah, Wario's was just general... This is me and my game! Uh, and each of the characters has theme for as far as their own shenanigans. Oh, yeah. So I didn't need to do anything. Uh, ha So as you complete the levels, the game gets, fast, gets faster and or harder depending on the stage the world that you're doing. Uh, you can't replay any of the stages afterwards and it just gets faster and harder as it goes along. Um, just super oh, yeah. Yep. Oh, yeah. But yeah. Uh, most of these little mini uh, stages usually only have 15 to like 25 levels. Uh, but you can go infinitely on any one of the difficulties and stages uh, post uh, completing them the first time. And of course, if you have a mini game that you really like but want to practice, um, you can play all of the mini games as soon as you've seen them at least once. Uh, you can play them infinitely uh, back to back to back. And we hear Punch Out. Uh, this is not Little Mac, he's uh, Big Mac. Uh, is this live or a restream? Uh, this is live, as it turns out. Imagine a week from now when this is actually a, uh, on the YouTube, it is no longer live. I will have lied to you! Mario never lies. He only embellishes the truth. <laughs> Future lies. Doggo. Smooth brew. So as you complete the stages, the characters kind of join you in your main scene here. Uh, and more and more da start dancing on the screen and whatnot. This is the, uh, the gelateria. Uh, for those who enjoy gelato as opposed to ice cream. Getting fancy with it here. You did it. You're moving on to the next three, man. Thanks, Jimmy. We'll see you in a bit. All right. Next, we have three different stages we can go. Uh, we have Dribble and Spitz, Mona, and Nine Volt. Nine Volt's my favorite for as far as the content, but we're going to go in order here. On to Dribble, who has some of the more strange games. And Dribble and Spitz run a taxi service, as you will see here shortly. In the Bronx. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have a good Bronx, Bronx accent, so I'm not even going to try. It was a dark night, and Batman was nowhere to be found. Meanwhile, next to the pizza shop and coffee shop, ooh, I just noticed that. It's time for Radio Eek. Okay, feed the kids. Where are you going? That voice. It was like the sea. 10-4, little buddy. And off we go. Into the rain. And so each stage has a little bit different scene in between to kind of keep track of your uh, lives at the stage level. Also known as Krygor Radio. And amazingly, this ride has already cost 77 grand. Uh, I would not want to ride this uh, ride this taxi ever at all. We're already charging them 77 grand, and they just got in the car. And 
dodge. We have dodged it. Technically. Technically is the best kind of technical. And stop. So some of the games do repeat across the little mini game sections, uh, but each section has their own uh, has their own flair, if you will. And catch. That's also one of the hardest ones in the game because that the timing on that's pretty tight on the other, the smaller pieces once you see it. Shoot. Got him. Sign me up for the next schmuck. Oh, go get. Uh, speaking of shmups, uh, you'll get to see one in this game. This game does have a lovely wide collection of game types. Uh, so if you want to try all sorts of video games, uh, WarioWare is a great one, uh, even if it is uh, bite sized amounts of them. Uh, cool! Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna stay right there. <laughs> I'm not even gonna move. You can't always do that, but you, when you can, it's, it's hilarious. Coffee. Hey, hey. <laughs> Autobots assemble. Moonlander. Alright, what's next? Stomp. I'm playing Mario. Wait, Wario. This one's actually a lot tougher than it looks. Oh, yeah. Especially when it starts getting faster. Hadouken! Hey, come on. Uh, hop. Yeah. So yeah, it does take a little bit of time to uh, get accustomed to all the mini games because they come out at random and for those who are good at randomizers, uh, this is the ultimate randomizer. So many different games, all in one. All right, uh, I did promise you a shmup. Here is the shmup. Uh, how dare you put a shmup in my game? But here we are. We are shmupping. Fully powered, so every green box that we get will not give us another power up, they will give us a, uh, an explosive. There we go. Gotta go fast. You can't speedrun a shmup. Oh, yes, you can. Oh, yes, you can. Oh, no, I missed one. I have failed you all. I think I want green. So I think the color denotes what kind of. Oh no, I hit it! Denotes what kind of effect the, uh, the orb will have in as far as a combat situation. Like this one will never leave the circle. Green will occasionally leave the circle so you can actually hit it. From score attack, right? Alright, and we're done with Dribble and Spits. And behold, the ending sequence for Dribble and Spits. FTK23 has finally gotten to the sea. Exactly what they were expecting to do. And behold, as they peer upon the great blacky distance of the night of the sea, they were a mermaid all along! Yes, that's right, ladies and gentlemen. The main character of our story is a mermaid. That is like the only time you get to see your own characters. Right there. <laughs> That's it. So if you choose male, the male will also turn into mermaid and give you pretty much the exact sequence. So that is really the only difference between choosing the male or female. And a hyper-realistic beach sunset, even though it's already nighttime. You know. Uh-oh, we forgot to collect the fair. Which is brilliant because, you know... 70 plus grand for a taxi ride sounds amazingly painful. And of course, Jill and Spitz gets to join us at the Galateria. Uh, Gelateria. Uh, eating their uh, gelato. Words are hard. Words are very hard. 
Whoa, hey, FTK23, all clear. We misjudged you, pal. Uh, no, we still didn't pay our fare, so you have not misjudged whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> so as you complete games and you go back through and complete more games, more of these little mini games uh, pop up. For instance, uh, if you ever get to watch any of the Winter Game, Winter Olympics, remember uh, curling? You've got a built-in curling game here, so lots of fun there. Uh, on to Mona, to the Gelateria, and there's the boss coming in, opening the store up. Getting ready to make some gelato. Delicious, delicious gelato. And up we go. And his name is Joe, by the way. Say hello to Joe. Come. And nowhere to be seen is Mona. There she is in the countryside in Italy. <laughs> or Greece. Or one of those... Uh, cities uh, from that area, or capitals, or whatever. Just have a nice ride along the seaside, halfway across the world, and for some reason there's pandas and kids and bears walking across the street. Oh no! We're gonna be late! We're halfway across the world! We've got five minutes to go from Europe to Japan. Also... Oh no, it's the fuzz! Run! How best to deal with the police, then? Vehicular assault! Let's go! <laughs> Trunk elephant! Oh, we're not done yet! Trunk pig! And we're still not done yet! Unleash the ultimate power! <laughs> Trunk Monkey! Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah, you're, that's right. We got Trunk Monkey. Let's go. <laughs> that monkey has seen some things. He has VR. Of course he's seen some things. Alright, more weird, realistic-ish games. We're gonna brush our teeth. Make sure you do that, everybody. Your teeth are important. We're going to catch the toast. I love toast. You like toast? I love toast. A little bit of butter. Perfect. Pick your nose. I will pick both of them at some point. But one nostril for now. You remember, Trunk Monkey? You take a promotion! And fireworks! Oh, yep, yep, yep. We're waiting for our long lost love of the sea. Snot drizzling from our nose. Eggs! Uh, let's see, let's aim. There we go. You're free from the flames. Uh, tilt. There we go. We are tilted. Go, drunk monkey! And got him. Chopsticks. Uh, oh, the airplane game, right. This is actually a full mini game, the airplane game, so you can go infinitely with that. Look out! No! Little kids trying to stop with the spiky little monster. How dare they? Red needle. There we go. <laughs> Something like that, yes. And eye drops. Fantastic. And here we are, already in the boss stage for Mona. And we get to hammer a nail. Best mini game ever. Don't miss. That's it. Whoa! Nice fix. Whoa! Nice fix. That's it. Well, look out! Fixed it. Awesome. Last one. Oh yeah. Like many of the randomizers I run, this is a total chaos game. Go, Mona, go! And behold, on time! Yeah, you still need to put your vest on and get set up and whatnot, so you're still heckin' late. 
Wink. How many of you have a job oh, like that? Wow. Where the door is open at 8, and if you come in at 8, you're late. There's a few of us, I'm sure, that have jobs like that. Get out of here! Wow! FTK23, girl, you did it! That's right. Alright, we get another game unlocked. I believe that one is uh, Chicken, where you you and your opponent rush to the edge of the cliff, and whoever stops the closest to the end uh, gets the win. Uh, so this was Dribble, which was sci-fi base. Mona was strange base. And now we have Nine Volt, which will be self-explanatory. My favorite mini game set of, of the lot. So you'll, you'll figure out pretty quick why. Go, Nine Volt! And we're obviously in California here. Nine Volt's house. Are you ready for this? You're not ready for this. penultimate gamer has his own device for putting in cartridges for him backwards here we are we are in the retro game uh, category uh, I don't know if you noticed that but we are going to play a bunch of retro games in a very short amount of time so we played three retro games in the last four seconds here. It's amazing. And F Zero. Look, everybody, I'm finally playing F Zero uh, 99. I win. That was easy. And Duck Hunt. Hex yeah. Let's see what else we got. Balloon Fight. Actually, a very good game. It's just uh, very, very difficult. Faster, faster, faster. And the best mini game within a game. There's some uh, mind blowing there. Hey, Zelda, we got to play Zelda as well. We beat that one as well. Look at that. Beating so many games so quickly. And Rob the Robot? Shoo. I still need to get a hold of one eventually. And apparently, something Atari esque. Oh, yeah, the, the precursor to the NES remix. Exactly. It is exactly that. Which is probably what gave them the idea to let's just make it its own game. Oh, 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 oh. Another brain. Another brain. Got her. And Virtual Boy, for those who are. Oh, get dunked on. 0 0.2 seconds. That reaction is amazing. <laughs> Holy crap. And then some random game that has nothing to do with any of the games that you saw earlier, other than there's Mario right there. All right, let's go. <laughs> Foul ball. <laughs> Home run. Foul ball. So, a la Duck Hunt, you have to hit at least six of the ten balls here. Otherwise, you fail. Oh, there goes one. And we did it. 0.2 seconds. That reaction time is stunning. <laughs> Hogan's Alley, by the way. This just in. The Game Boy Advanced SP is here. <gasps> Pick on up today. <gasps> <gasps> and screw the wheels, we have hoverboard. Ha <laughs> ha! This is me every time a new game comes out that I that I want to get. Right there. Just like that. Apparently it's based on an actual toy from 1968 that shot ping pong balls. I believe it. And there is our main little man, Ninevolt. Of course, playing his SP in the background. Doesn't care about gelato. Just cares about DBA. I have never been more terrified of Mario. So, yes, I do have a lovely... <laughs> thing in the corner there that is Wario wearing a Metroid power suit 
Oh yeah. Yeah, I went there. All right, on to tier two of the remix number one, uh, which this is the sports genre. So this is remix number one, uh, which starts you immediately on difficulty two and I believe a faster speed as well. So Jimmy returns with a new do. Uh, yellow, I believe, in this case. Just a barely do. Wario. Probably. Alright, so this starts off harder. So these stages are the ones to watch out for. These ones get difficult. Technically. It's the same game. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Those pizza boxes hey, on. on a unicycle. I actually kind of disagree oh, with that, no, but no. it's fine. It's fine. Oh, I, I, okay. Um, I'm just gonna stop that right there. Uh, you did. Yo didn't see a thing. Hey, you didn't see a thing. Hey, Boink. There we go. Use the right finger this time. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Come on. Uh, jump. Um, what happened? My stream buffered. That's fine. You didn't, you didn't miss anything. I had to start a little slower on the stage, but it's fine. Hey, DJ. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And don't ask me why we're blowing up Mars because apparently we're just gonna blow. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah. All right. Uh, hey. Ah. Also a real toy. Uh, nice. Smaller pan, bigger egg. You can't, sometimes you can't fire fast enough on that game. Oh. <laughs> I have failed Shmup level 2. Uh, go, 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 failed go. the ghosty, though. The boo. Jump. Uh, that was also supposed to be a jump. He didn't see a thing! You not see us, neither did they. Oh, no, oh, no we're going to have to do it again. <laughs> we're going to have to do it again. <laughs> No, we're definitely gonna have to do it again. Ah, <laughs> uh, so I, I, you didn't see a dang thing. <laughs> I definitely saw that one. No, you didn't. <laughs> I play perfectly. I have never failed a game ever. I get. I disagree with that. Wow, I am uh, I am having a moment now. Uh, I'm having several moments. Good enough. Speed one. Thank you. There. I missed, but I got it the second time. Go 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 go. Got it. No. Go, 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 go. <sighs> close. Close. Nailed it. <laughs> I do apologize for the coughing. I've been having a lot of allergies just lately. Nailed it. Consummate bees. Consummate bees. Dude, wouldn't know Mad Steve and bit him in the back. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Got it that time. Oh, point four that time. Not so good. Not so good. Still got the eye. There we go. Uh, up, up, right. Hadouken. I know. Point zero four. How dare I? So slow. And a point two earlier. Which is ridiculous. 
But I think on the hardest fast, you're expected to do 0.4. It's the absolute... Punch! Wait for it, wait for it. This is as close as I'll ever get to playing punch through Punch-Out, right here. Super Punch, don't get hit. And that is Remix 1. Like you did it. It was terrible, but you did it. First try, right? Exactly. First try, every other try. Cheap. Oh, yeah. Nice beat. Hey, you cleared it. Move on to the next three, man. And so we shall. Up next, we have Orbulon, Dr. Krygor, and Kitten. Kit cat or uh, Kitana. Cat Nana. Yeah, Cat Nana. I said Keaton Cat. Cat Nana. Kitana. Alright, on Orbulin. Was that a hamster on his phone? Uh, it was a sheep, I think. So, our alien of the game. Ironically, not the weirdest thing in the game. Oh no! Orbulon just got hit by a meteor! Or an asteroid, technically. Red alert! Red alert! We've been struck! Evacuate! Evacuate! No capes. Sus! Sus! Oh, a hello, friendly neighbor. Can you uh, help me out here? <laughs> we are friendly neighbors. Here is elevator on chain. Ah. All right. Oh, a little off center, but it'll do the job. And now, the game. Count. One, two, three. You did it! Match. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Rudimentary games. Counting, matching. Uh, this one. Making cup noodles. Some cup noodles. I could go for some cup noodles. Alright, praise. The game is terrible, depressing, intriguing. That's encouraging. All three of those. I don't know what you're talking about. Inspect. It looks like a Game Boy, and it's pink. Uh, this one? No! I can't match. I don't know why that was off, but it was off somehow. Decide. I've decided that this one is missing an eyeball. Watch. That is an X. With a red card. Alright, remember. Write down. Ooh, ooh, DDR. Good! Thanks, Nate. Appreciate it. Search. Uh, I can see you just barely over here. There you are. Green. Alright, watch out. Uh, 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 uh. Squish. Speed up. Heavier. What's heavier? Um, those look bigger. Alright, choose. Oh, I know this game very well. Playing Super Mario RPG. I uh, can't. Meow. Most wins. Blue. This one's a very, very rudimentary comparison. I still failed one. <laughs> I still failed one. Outwit. Now RPG time. Ah, oh, it's Hungra. You can attack now. What will you do? Pile driver or Pied Piper? Pile driver! Oh, that hurt a little bit. Hunger is attacking. What will you do? Escape or escalate? Uh, escalate's pretty quick. Hunger's attack does not affect you. Try using magic. What will you use? Max scout, max out. It's on the ropes. Last chance. Time it and press A. Success! I just choose to win. That's all. I just choose to win. 
win every time because I choose to. Why? Why do you persist? Because I choose to. Gutling, prepare to be dazzled by alien powers. Ah, oh, shucks. It's just an alien. Dump him! Eject. Such nice aliens to come help and then they just eject him. Straight down to the planet. And, by the way, Orbulon is... Super tiny. And he's just gonna keep going in and out of his ship because his elevator's broken. You have cleared. Does not compute. No, not, not particularly. <laughs> Alright. So, we've got four more stages left. Uh, next one is going to be Dr. Krygor. Uh, which has got some very, very um, interesting things. By the way, I, I have the, uh, the Dong Dong. I don't know what that is. Chicken race. And then, of course, the, uh, the shuffle that book. Dr. Krygor's are reality. <laughs> Some of us have some very, very reality here with uh, Thanksgiving recently. Uh, by the way, just a quick note, we are... Dom Don never died. We are raising money for Feed the Kids. Uh, I do encourage you to hit that exclamation mark, donate, and donate to Feed the Kids for Marathon. It's 100% proceeds going to, bring, uh, to uh, Random X to Feed the Kids. And, oh no! Dr. Craigor, don't drink the random elixir that you've just made. Oh no! Time to eject! And like any good, after any good meal, or bad meal, technically, straight to the loo! <laughs> Come on, you can do it! Why you choose to have a ladder instead of a staircase? And of course, the loo. With a bidet! Here we go. It's time to make a pepper. Uh, it's the yellow one. That is freaky. Reflect. I have reflected. Look at that lovely mob rose mountain side. Lovely. Uh, cut. Oh, I think go for some steak, too. I think nothing. It is certainly a game. It is a fantastic game. And they've made one or two for pretty much every Nintendo console, Game Boy Advance, and on. So, highly encourage you to check out literally any of them. They're all just about as crazy. I am bouncing a watermelon off of somebody. Eat! Even the core. Yes. Just don't eat the seeds. Just take knuckles enough. Too raw. Needs to be well done. Oh no! The cat was not asleep. I lost the roll of toilet paper because the cat was not asleep. Drop. Perfect. Ah, we're fine. <laughs> it's fine. Don't worry about it. Aw, oh, we shook the doggy's ball. Avengers assemble! Uh, spray. Obviously, this is a bidet. You filling up gaps yourself there. <coughs> you don't worry about it. Alright, time to save the world with my eye lasers. This one's actually probably the hardest boss sequence because these things are so unpredictable. And, uh, well, not unpredictable, but they're just hard to hit. These especially. And if even one of those gets through, you, you lose. Suddenly, he's sort of a schmuck. Fifteen times, but we got it down. Ah, oh, make sure you wash your hands. Oh, oh no! Even the toilet didn't want it. Return to sender. Return to sender. That is super gross. I'm just saying. Oh no! Eject. And the toilet said nah. 
and we can fly, except we can't. And the lovely burb saves the day. The one time the jerk is not a burb. Uh, the, the, the burb is not a jerk. Yeah, both true. <laughs> both true. <laughs> Jerk. And he's just gonna flop into existence there. There he is. Dr. Krygor just floating around in midair somehow. Very good indeed. My FTK 23 theory was valid. Yes. Uh, Alright, so out of curiosity, have we gotten any donations recently? No, come on, peeps. Can I get at least can you get at least one donation for the cause here today? Come on, come on. I know you got it in there. I know you got it. Yeah, you can do one. All right, uh, Katana, let's go. Cat and Anna. Windows XP layout, right? Behold, oh, the second time you quote see your own character. Except the first time you're a boy or girl, and this time you're a still a boy or a girl, but you're like a shinobi leader, blah, 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 blah. But you're cursed! But you get to play mini games. That's good. But it's cursed. That's bad. Princess FTK23 must be saved. Go, cat. Throw the doggo ninjas at him. Come challenge me. Bonk. And done. That's Anna, I think, actually. Yeah, other way. Thank you. Meanwhile, uh, game over, man. Game over. Yeah, there's Cat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ninja Girl, save me! You betcha. By the way, note to the dog. The dog will play a critical role in this. Princess FTK23 cannot come to the phone. She's a little tied up right now. <laughs> little Shiba Inu. It's a lovely drawing of a, of a pagoda. Here to defeat you. Come to me on my way up. Nice. That is a flying squirrel. And up. <laughs> Chomp. No, 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 Speed up, by the way. <laughs> by the way, that's a speed up or something we can do. March, do not bop the other penguins. They will own you. Doge. I like Doge. No! Clear. Uh, feed the baby, feed the baby, help the squirrel, move along. Pick. I've been picking all day. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna move over here. Hi. Drop. Got him. Koala got a coconut. Sweep the leg. Sweep the leg. Catch. Uh, catch fruit. Okay. Speed up. 
Oh, yeah, I gotta move. <laughs> it's like, oh, yeah, I actually have to play the game. Hold on. No, kitty, don't get wet. Mm. Got it. Scare him. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Got him. Domo Kun. Kind of. Grab. Pick up. Got him. Yeah, there's a lot of so many different random little games that some of them are very difficult to figure out on the first time that you see them. Uh, some of these, uh, Jump King and all, uh, are, are not that difficult. But some of them are like, go left! Okay. Do complicated math! The heck? Ba, 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 da. You can, if you're trying to be fast, skip a few clouds. You can. I mean, if you're trying to go fast. I'm not really trying to go fast, I'm just trying to beat the game. <coughs> tried to skip one there and it's like no you're not skipping anything and into the drink <laughs> ah the potato has reached the drink and... let's go cat nana you guys got this hoorah let's go nope, nope, nope. and she's down but wait, what's this? The real hero of the story! Get jumped on! This dog was a sword all along! How's he better than Super Mario Brothers? Such strength! I am destroyed! Ow. And behold, the dog saves the day. <laughs> A nine, eight point five, nine point five, six. Always, always that one judge. Always. And Cat Nana go to the gelateria because gelato is for everybody. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, come on, come on. Princess FTK23, you are the victor. Impressive. All right, we have two more stages left. Uh, one of which arguably uh, uh, the more difficult. They're both difficult. So this is remix number two, which is everything's on hard and faster. So Jimmy's back for a third time and only a third time because we did not have to redo his stage at all, even once. And nobody could say otherwise. And now he's got a red, red uh, phone and a red hairdo. Remember those flip phones? They're great. Praise attractive. Oh, yeah. <laughs> First try every time. Yay! I will not also have to redo this one 15 times. Don't worry about it. It has never happened before. Ever. And especially not today. Eat! Two eat ones out of out of three so far. Inspect. That looks like a Game Boy. And it looks like a normal Game Boy, so I'm gonna pick that one. Cut. Oh, that is a thick steak. That is a oh, thick steak with two C's. Oh, let's go drop. Got him. Catch a uh, fruit. That is a fruit. Fight. Remember, left, down, left. 
left down left to a dance. Thank you, Snape. Until next time. March. Who dies? Oh no! They didn't move! Oops! You didn't see a dang thing! Oh no, oh no. That was easy to lose one or two. I got him. Adventures assemble! That is absolutely what a car looks like. That is absolutely what a car looks like. I don't need no stinking wheels. Uh, that one. Good assembly. Shush! Double shake. That's right. Uh, jump. <laughs> Cover. Kitty, 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 no. One, two, three. Go, 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 go. Smooshed. And on to the boss time. So you saw Punch Out 1. You saw Punch Out 2. Guess what we're doing next? You're wrong. Punch Out 4. We skipped one. There we go. Ow! Straight. <laughs> straight to Tyson. Straight to Tyson. Ow. Got him. That was rough. That was rough. We got there. All right, on to the final stage. After we say hello and goodbye to uh, Jimmy one more time. Doing a little shimmy. Oh, uh, pink phone. Oh, uh, red phone. It changed. It was pink in one screen. It's See, it's pink there. <laughs> I remember owning a phone that looked something like that. Oh, you're all clear. You're cool, man. But next up is Wario. Really? I thought we were playing Wario all along. Anyways, on to the, the hardest stage of the game, theoretically. Uh, and there's the airplane game, by the way, that popped in there, right? Wario! Anything goes. Anything from any game can appear, can appear here. And generally at the hardest difficulty. And you have beholden the entirety of WarioWare. Story mode. Except for the final piece. My games are the hardest yet. Ta-da! I'm just going to throw this in the air. Because this is what you do with your electronics. Please don't do this with your electronics. It can fly! <laughs> Wario is now a computer. Here we go. Collect. I can do that. <laughs> okay, so I kind of have to do real fo actual focus time here. Give me a few moments. Munch? Not at all. Actual focus time. Dodge? Question mark. <laughs> He's so tiny. Pinball. Yay! We played pinball too. There we go. Get that flag up there. It's, it's just a pair of underwear. Design. <laughs> Right on the boat. Shake. And excite bike. Oh no! I tried to get fancy and shoot twice and I missed. Drops. 
Got him. My cake. All right, we have one shot at this. Did I have to redo it? We have one shot at this. And we know in previous events, it's taken at least one try. Also, I cannot play Worth a Dark. Got him. Grab yon treasure! Success! It's the Golden Poop! Alright! Alright, let's go. Indiana Jones it! We're out of here! And, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, that is WarioWare Story Mode. And I will allow the uh, end sequence to play out here as we, uh, we get ready to close off this segment again. Appreciate everybody for joining me for WarioWare Story Percent. Uh, plenty more shenanigans coming up after me. Uh, you still got another full day and a half worth of shenanigans for your faces. Um, unfortunately, I don't think any more Wario, unless... Unless a certain Mar Wario happens to pop up on a certain cart here. But anyways, again, thank you all for joining us, and I uh, hope you enjoyed WarioWare. Stay tuned. Up next, we have some more Mario fun from a uh, not-Mario character. Uh, that's right. Next up, we're going to have Yoshi's Safari. Oh, actually, I guess Mario's in that, too. I guess. <laughs> I guess. All right. Hang tight. We'll be back.